I think actually there are, there are of course, many uh, uh, useful uh, recommendations, but the several I think are very important for China. And the one that's really, uh, I think, a lot of people emphasize uh, is the uh, diversification of the uh, institutions that's, you know, uh, are offering uh, tertiary education, uh, 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 you know, uh, the, the, the need for diversification. I think that's a very important message uh, because I think in, in general that, uh, you know, tertiary education, people only think about that as just university education. But of course it's not. It's, you know, many form in, in many format, in many uh, kind of, a, you know, uh, education that's offered after uh, the second, uh, secondary education. And so I think that message, I think, would be very important for China. Uh, so I think uh, that that is sort of one uh, important issue. And the other thing, of course, is uh, talking about the capacity building, um, you know, for uh, 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 emerging markets. And in China, there's also great, uh, you know, diversity and disparities. So while, you know, Beijing and Shanghai and so on are very well developed, but also there are some developing regions within China. The capacity building is a, a key uh, challenge. And also, I think there are uh, some very practical issues. I think one recommendation talked about the differentiated faculty salary is important for maintaining inequality. And so that's, you know, people might think that's very, so, you know, nitty gritty, but I think that's very important for administrators in, 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 in emerging markets. I think that uh, what makes the EMS conference different is that, first of all, I think uh, this, uh, the, in terms of the people, who are very uh, coming from very diverse background, very distinguished, you know, background and so on. But they, when they come here, they're in a very uh, low formality, and so that's the one thing that distinguishes, you know, from others. And the other thing is the format, how discussion is conducted. And instead of having long presentations and the very structured uh, uh, discussions and so on, but this one focus on the exchange of ideas very careful deliberation of key ideas. And also people think about how this might have an impact. So I think those sort of features that makes this one really different. The many people um, now realize that when we talk about development, uh, the key is actually human development. And uh, in, in the past, people have focused very much on the, you know, the growth, the GDP and so on, but ultimately, if we could not, improve the welfare of people, then it means nothing. So I think the issues that's been picked by EMS last year, I think I was told it was on a, a health issue, and this year on education, these are all of key importance for people in, in, in emerging markets. I think it's absolutely, I think, a, a great idea to continue to support uh, EMS by the Templeton uh, College, because I think universities are places to generate ideas and improve people's human, uh, the, the, the welfare of the people. So this, I couldn't think of better format than EMS in achieving this goal.